بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم سالار خان ہیر اینڈ کنٹینیوئنگ دا ٹاپک نمبر سسٹمس آؤٹ آف وچ دا فرسٹ نمبر سسٹم دیٹ وی ڈسکس از دا بائنری نمبر سسٹم دا ڈیسیمل از آف کورس دا نارمل سسٹم دیٹ وی یوز ان آر ڈیلی لائف 10 پلس 5 از 15 اینڈ 20 پلس 22 از 42 اینڈ 5 ملٹیپلائی 2 از 10 اینڈ 10 ڈیوائڈ بائی 5 از 2 اینڈ دیٹس اے نارمل اوکے سو دا سسٹم دیٹ وی ڈسکس ٹوڈے is the binary number system binary number system all right and what is this binary number system we have already seen in the previous uh, brief introduction that we have the base or r is equal to 2 so we have only two distinct digits that is in the set of binary we have a zero and we have a one all right zero and one and uh, we also know that this binary number system is a weighted system which means that each and every position has its own weight all right how so let's uh, see a number one zero one zero one one zero one zero one all right so this could also cover your binary to decimal conversion okay so uh, we see now over here uh, the system has a base two so which means starting from here this number has its way two to the power zero this has two to the power one this one a two power two, this a two power three, and a two power four. As we saw in the previous lecture, we uh, uh, discussed the weights of uh, in the in the decimal system, which was a ten to the power zero, ten to the power one, ten to the power two, and so on. Similarly, for every base, for every base, the value of r, and you describe the powers r to the power zero, r to the power one. If this is a base 8 system, which means the octal system, so you do what? The first one has the weight 8 to the power 0, 8 to the power 1, 8 to the power 2, and so on. This is a base 2 system, so this has the weight 2 to the power 0, 2 to the power 1, and so on. If we have a decimal over here, and after that we have values, so we go to the negative side. So after this we have a 2 to the power negative 1 which you'll be seeing in the conversions, okay? This is just for a simple explanation that each of these has its weight. Now, uh, each of these each of these ones and zeros, these are called bits. These are called bits. These one and zeros are called bits, all right? And each of this bit is set to be high when it is a one. And it is set to be low when it is a zero. And it is set to be an on when it is a one and off when it is a zero. All right. And we take the, 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 the sum now and the sum is taken of the high values only. So two to the power zero is high and two to the power two is high and two to the power four is high. So two to the power zero is one. 2 to the power 2 is 4 and 2 to the power 4 is 16. So 16 plus 4 plus 1 is 21. So which means the decimal equivalent is 21. Or I can write this as 10101 in, uh, in binary is equal to 21 in decimal. So this is also covered here by to decimal conversion part all right now we have the next concept of the most significant bit and least significant bit most significant and uh, the next is what least significant bit what is the most significant bit? This uh, we have a short name is MSB and we have LSB over here. Most significant is the leftmost bit. Leftmost bit. 
and the rightmost bit is the least significant. Now, what does this mean? Significant. You know what, what significant means? Significant means important. And how is the leftmost the most important? And how is the rightmost the least important? So we see this through the same example. Let's say we've seen that 10101 is equal to 21. Okay. Now if I change this, the, the rightmost bit, the, the leftmost bit, let's say. What? The leftmost is the most significant, the rightmost is the most least significant. So let's say I change the right significant. So 10100, zero, 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 I make it. Okay? So uh, this in uh, binary would now be equal to 2 to the power 0, 2 to the power 1, 2 to the power 2 is high, and 2 to the power 4 is high. 2 to the power 2 plus 2 to the power 4, which makes it a uh, 16 plus 4, which is a 20 which he makes it a 20 in the decimal number system. So which means we only got a difference of 1. 21 and 20 has only a difference of 1. Now if I change the most significant bit, the rightmost bit, let's say this is a 0. 0. 1, 0, 1 in binary. So now 2 to the power uh, 0 is high and 2 to the power 2 is high. 2 to the power 0 plus 2 to the power 2, which makes it a 5 in the decimal number system. So now this had made a difference of 16 by changing the, the left most bit, which means the most significant bit. So that is why these are called the non most significant and the least significant. Just have a look why the differences are changing them, all right? We have a very less difference and we have a greater difference by changing the most significant bit. Alright? So this is all about the most significant and the least significant bits. Alright? Uh, well, now the bit is the smallest unit of uh, representing a data. Bit is the smallest unit of data. Bit is the smallest unit of data okay then we combine different bits okay uh, and then what do we get we get a nibble one nibble is four bits then we have a byte one byte is eight bits okay then we have a word, one word, which is a combination of 16 bits. And then we have a double word, one double word, which is a 32 bits. All right. So this is about the bits. Now, in the binary uh, system of numbers, as we have the... Uh, we, in the decimal system, as we have the uh, addition, subtraction, and multiplication division, similar is the case over here. We have uh, over here also. So let me remove this and then we study the binary addition. All right, so now the binary addition. Binary addition. Now as we have zeros and ones only, so we will be seeing that zero plus zero, we have zero. Zero plus one is one. One plus zero is also one. And then we have 1 plus 1 is 1, 0. All right. And how is this? So over here we have uh, uh, sum is 0 and carry is 0. Here we have sum is 1 or here also sum is 1 and carry is 0 in both the cases. 
Over here we have the sum is 0, but carry is 1. And we'll see in the conversions also, 1, 0, let me convert it, 1, 0. So this is 2 to the power 0, this is 2 to the power 1. 2 to the power 1 is high, so which means only this is taken, and 2 to the power 1 is 2 in decimal number system. All right, now, now we take an example. Let's say we have a 1, 1, 0 plus 1, 0, 1. 1, 1, 0 plus 1, 0, 1. Now, 1, 0 plus 1 is a 1. 1 plus 0 is again a 1. And 1 plus 1, we have 0 is the sum and 1 is the carry. So we don't have anything here. This 1 comes out to be here and this is the answer. All right. This is binary addition. Simple as it is. Another example, let's say I have. 1, 1, uh, 0, 1, 1, 1, 1, 0, 1, 1, plus 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, and 1. Okay, so now 1 plus 1 is a 0 sum and 1 is a k. Now again over here, have a look. Now we have three ones over here. So for a group of three ones, we, this is three. So one, one, one is the equivalent for three. Sorry. One, one is the equivalent. Uh, so one, one is the equivalent for uh, three in decimal. All right. And if we have a group of four ones, uh, if we have four in uh, decimal, so this one zero zero is for four. This is what we need to remember, okay? So then we'll be using it maybe again and again, mostly. Now over here we have, have a look, three, one, two, and three. So which makes one as their sum, and again one as their carry. 1 as their sum and 1 as their carry. All right? And then 1 plus 1 is again a 0 as a sum and 1 is a carry. Now again we have three ones, so which makes 1 a sum and 1 a carry. Now two ones are again one, 0 is the sum and 1 is a carry. So the, this makes it the answer. This is what you need to remember, okay? 1, 0 is a 2. 3 is 1, 1, and 4 is 1, 0, 0. All right. Now, the next we have is a binary subtraction. Binary subtraction. One one zero one 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 zero one one minus one zero one one zero. 1, 0, 1, 1, 0. Now have a look. 1 minus 0 would be a 1. 1 minus 1 would be a 0. But what about 0 minus 1? So for 0 minus 1, we'll, may, we'll take a carry. So this 1 has now been carried over here, 1. So this becomes 1, 0. And 1, 0 is what? 1, 0 is 2. So 2 minus 1 is a 1. Now this turned out to be 0 as we've taken the 1 from here. So now again we borrow. Again now this becomes a 1, 0. And, uh, sorry. No, no, sorry. This is a uh, 0. So 0 minus 0 is a 0. All right, zero minus zero is a zero, and one minus one is also zero. So the answer to this can simply be one, zero, one. All right, let's have a look at another example. One, 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 zero, one, 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 zero, minus one, one, one. Now have a look. 
zero, oh, one cannot be subtracted from zero, so we take a bar. So this becomes a one zero. One zero minus a one, now this would be one. This has now become a zero, so this cannot be subtracted. Now we take another bar from here, this becomes a one zero, and this left out to be zero. So over here we have a one zero minus one is again a one, all right? Now, now here it is left again to be zero, and this one remains, so we take another borrow to make this a one zero. One zero minus one again is a one, and this thing was changed to be zero, so the answer is a zero, one, one, one. All right? We also have the binary multiplication and binary division, which I believe we will be covering in the next lecture, inshallah, as time is being pushed. So that's all for today. Thank you very much for watching. See you very soon, inshallah. Till then, goodbye.